It looks like such a nice day outside, doesn't it? It's so sunny. It looks like it should be so warm and wonderful. But don't let none of that sunshine fool you. Got me going into work looking like a whole snow bunny. Hostage. Why are you going this way? Ow! <laughs> I'm trying to help you out, brother. That's how my dad did it. <laughs> did you ever get your belt, boo? Okay. Does it fit? tries to do. Me. Who's going to change the world? Me. Yes, you are. Theo, Daddy said we're going to have the pizza party on Friday, but that just told of how we listen. We have to do our priority without being told to. And Mommy's going to make you guys a priority chart, okay? Yeah, so, so when we get home, we're going to make us a priority chart. Yeah, when I get back home, I'll try to print it out for you guys. That way, when you wake up in the morning, it'll tell you everything you need to do and you can just check it off as you do it. What happened? Want me to go to my job and trick them? But it, but it isn't polite to trick people who like it because I, I because I read a book for my class. It was it was uh, an auntie learned a lesson. A Nancy tricked Turtle. He Turtle washed his hands, but a Nancy told Turtle to wash his hands again. So a non so first a Nancy ate half of the banana, then a Nancy ate all. All right, boys, have an excellent day. I love you, and I'll see you when I get home. So I'm back in the house from dropping off the boys. Um, finishing my coffee. I haven't even had breakfast yet. I really don't even know what I want. It may just be like a bagel with cream cheese today because I just, I don't, or maybe I should do a smoothie. I haven't done a smoothie in some time. So maybe I'll just do a smoothie. But I'm gonna finish my coffee, make a smoothie, and then it's workout time again. And this time it's not gonna be the Mr. London workout. Like, don't get me wrong, it was a very good workout. Heart rate was all up. Like, I'm just, I'm not there yet. My body's not ready for that yet. So I'm just gonna do um, another like more, not lightweight, but pretty much a lightweight workout <laughs> just for today just to get me back into the swing of things because all Mr. London taught me in that workout is that I am direly out of shape 
and I need to ease into the process. We're going to ease on into it. We, we're not just going to jump off the cliff like we did the last time. All right, let me finish my coffee. I made it. The usernames of the 16 on this I survived. Now we know how to make contact. Thanks. Oh. My mouth is so dry, I need to get some water. <sighs> but I survived. The Mr. London workout, that was truly a struggle. Like when I said I wasn't gonna let y'all watch me struggle through that workout, it was a struggle. But this one, like I'm out of breath. My legs hurt. I added on my uh, the 50 squat challenge. Have you guys seen that on Facebook? I added that on to the workout. So did some ab stuff and my 50 squats. But yeah, that was a pretty decent morning workout. I don't know what everybody else listens to when they work out. Like, let me know down in the description box below what kind of music do you listen to when you work out. But like normally, I would work out to like some gangster rap kind of stuff. I don't know what it was about it. it. Just made me work harder for some reason. But lately, I've been using the um, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse soundtrack. Has anybody else listened to that? Like, it is really good. And the songs are perfect for a workout. Now I need to go pick out what I'm wearing, get dressed, shower get dressed that's three and then get ready for work i also need to make like a lunch or like snacks or something because even though i do get home today daylight it's wonderful like normally working to till close isn't a problem like i appreciate the money but i just want to come home some days while the sun is still out like and it's not so darn cold but okay, let me get myself together and in order and all that stuff. It looks like such a nice day outside, doesn't it? It's so sunny. Looks like it should be so warm and wonderful. But don't let none of that sunshine fool you. Got me going into work looking like a whole snow bunny. <sighs> this is ridiculous. So going to work today they asked yesterday if I wanted to do extra hours like you know since it's so busy because Christmas is next week is Christmas next week yes Christmas is next week I think yeah it's next week I'm so out of it um I'm about to go in here do these extra hours hopefully everybody comes in like they got some sense because I'm just, I can't wait for this year to be over. I can't wait for this week to be over this day. I'm just over a lot of stuff. <sighs> Let me go run in here before I freeze to death. <sighs> okay, so here we are eight hours later. Just got home from work and I'm about to cook myself some dinner. Um, Because all we have is spaghetti but I can't eat the noodles. 
because I'm really trying. I'm really, really trying to do clean keto. So I'm going to make um, myself some salad. But to go with the salad, I'm going to do some balsamic salmon. Yes. Take some of my balsamic vinaigrette and season up some salmon that we have, well, that I have because nobody else in this house eats fish but me. But I had in the freezer for a while now. I'm going to cook the, all that up, basically like do a nice little meal prep. And yeah, have dinner. Let's get the cooking. I'm exhausted, can you tell? Oh boy, all right, let's cook. And so, through the magic of television, the food is done. There is my salmon, there is my salad with blue cheese dressing, my big old tumbler full of water. And I'm about to eat this and take myself to bed. That is a wrap on day two of our 12 days of Christmas. I hope you all had a wonderful, beautiful, magical, amazing day. And please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe. I almost forgot what I was about to say. That's how tired I am. Like, I'm done, y'all. <laughs> I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye. Can I take you there? Can I take you there?